April 14, representatives of the Savior maintain good conduct again among the Gentiles so that in case they speak against you as wrongdoers, they may see your good deeds and glorify God on the day of visitation, 1 Peter 2.12, Revised Standard Version. God expects those who bear the name of Christ to represent him. They are to be a sanctified, purified, holy people, communicating light to all with whom they come in contact. The followers of Christ are to be separate from the world in principles and interests, but they are not to isolate themselves from the world. The Savior mingled constantly with men, not to encourage them in anything that was not in accordance with God's will, but to uplift and ennoble them. I sanctify myself, he declared, that they also might be sanctified, John 17:19. So the Christian is to abide among men that the savor of divine love may be a salt to preserve the world from corruption. The power of a higher, purer, nobler life is our great need. The world is watching to see what fruit is borne by professed Christians. Impressions favorable or unfavorable to Bible religion are constantly being made on the minds of all with whom we have to do. And God and the angels are watching. God desires his people to show by their lives the advantage of Christianity over worldliness, to show that they are working on a high, holy plane. He longs to see them showing that the truth they have received has made them children of the heavenly king. He longs to make them channels through which he can pour his boundless love and mercy. Christ is waiting with longing desire for the manifestation of himself in his church. When the character of the Savior shall be perfectly reproduced in his people, then he will come to claim his own. It is the privilege of every Christian not only to look for, but to hasten the coming of our Lord. Were all who profess his name bearing fruit to his glory, how quickly the whole world would be sown with the seed of the gospel. Quickly the last great harvest would be ripened, and Christ would come.